Hey, what's going on, boys and girls? It's me, Jake the Happy Snaker, and welcome back to my Pokemon Gold walkthrough. In the last part, I left Mr. Pokemon's house, and I made my way back to Newbark Town, and, but before I actually was able to get back to Newbark Town, I was stopped by that abusive child who kicked me, and I battled him, and I beat him, and then I went back to Professor Elm's lab, I named my rival, stuff like that. And in this part, I'm going to officially begin my journey in the Johto region. Um, and I'm also, in this part, I'll, I'm also going to catch my my second team member, and I'm going to make my way to Violet City, which has the first gym in it. So, yeah. So, once you officially begin your journey, you're going to walk out here, and this guy is going to stop you. I've seen you a couple times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Well, none, because I wasn't really able to catch Pokemon up until now, so... Would you like me to show uh, show you how to catch Pokemon? No, I don't have time for your crap, okay? I know how to catch Pokemon. I, seriously, I've caught, like, almost every legendary Pokemon there is, except for the event ones and stuff like that. But anyways, um, now, I actually, the first Pokemon I'm going to catch, uh, the first Pokemon I'm going to encounter is going to be the one that I'm going to catch. Alright, you guys will see why. Um, and yeah. The first Pokemon I'll find will be the one that I'll encounter. Okay, seriously, but I don't... When I want to find a Pokemon, when I don't want to find a Pokemon, um, I find a Pokemon. And when I want to find a Pokemon, I don't find one. Like, seriously, that's just my luck. Alright, then we'll just, uh, go here. Okay, now, I know, what you, I, know what you, I know exactly what you guys are going to think when you first see this guy. Now, it is clear, uh, clearly it's impossible to find a Murkrow on the first route of this game. Well, I am a genius. You know, and I use uh, cheat codes. Hold on a second. I use cheat codes, of course, because that's what I do. But it, you actually can find this guy. Uh, you can you can actually find Markro um, in the game, but not until later on. But I will put the cheat code to find Markro in the description. And if you wanna, you no, know, if you wanna have the cheat code to find any other Pokemon, uh, you know, like any legendaries or whatever, just message me or comment or whatever, and I'll answer your comment and I'll give you the I'll give you, I will give you the cheat code. Um, so yeah, and also another thing I had to do is I did have five, uh, I did have five Pokeballs, but I had to cheat to get Master Balls, because I think it's actually impossible to catch Pokemon that you use with, um, that you use, with, um, you, that you use cheats to, to find. I think it's impossible to actually, um, catch them with Pokeballs or whatever, because I seriously try to, um, I seriously, I seriously try to catch this guy with a Pokeball, and I tried so many times, and I just failed, and it actually knows Peck. At level, like, I found level 2s, and you know, peck, and that's, clearly, that's, you know, terrible against my Chikorita, and I didn't really have much of a chance, so I just cheated, and, um, I got 5 Master Balls, like, I used cheats to turn my, my Pokeballs into Master Balls, which is totally okay with me, so pretty much all the Pokemon that I'm gonna catch will probably be used with cheat codes, and we be, and I will be using Master Balls on them, but all the Pokemon that I do catch for my team, I will, um, have... The cheat code in the description once I once I actually catch them. So yeah, I will have the cheat code. I will have the cheat code to catch Murkrow in the description. Also, like I said, if you guys want to have cheat code to any other Pokemon, to find, you know, um, if you want to find any other Pokemon like ho -Oh and whatever, just message me and I will give you guys the cheat code. So yeah, yeah, my first team member is Murkrow. All right, now time to go find a Dusk Stone so I can evolve into a Honchkrow. No, I'm kidding. Um, so yeah, let's just speed to Cherry Grove. Oh, look at another Murkrow. Okay, I better turn this cheat code off, actually. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, that's the one, I believe. And, okay, now we'll just see if it worked. Yep, okay, I did. Alright, cool. Now let's, go the, uh, now let's go inside the Pokemon Center. Heal up. Wait, why am I healing? I don't have to heal. What the heck? My Pokemon weren't even damaged. Alright, that was stupid. Alright, anyways. So, yeah, I am going to put Murkrow on the front, front of my party. And I actually... Um... I actually, uh, like, I like Murkrow, it's a pretty cool Pokemon, a flying and fight, a flying and dark type Pokemon is cool, because we all know that dark types are weak to fighting type Pokemon, but, um, if you have, like, a flying and dark, flying and dark type, then obviously fighting type moves won't be very good, um, so, yeah, Murkrow, plus I need a flying type so I can fly around, because my past two walkthroughs, I had no flying types on my team, so I had to go into my PC, and, because, you know, I, ha I had to get a Sparrow in Ruby, not a Sparrow, a Farfetch in Ruby, because I cheat for that. And then I have a Sparrow in Blue. So, yeah, now I, have a, I now have a Murkrow to fly me around. Anyways, time for the first trainer battle. 
I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Um, yeah, I'm gonna speed through this because I don't feel like. Yeah, all I, all he knows is Peck. Wow, I thought he actually knew a different move, but all he knows is Peck. Okay. What? How did? What? Oh, you're. Oh, I hate you. You're cheapo. Okay, you're. Ah, oh, man. I should have that. That experience should have went to Murkrow. Okay, Murkrow needs experience. Uh, whatever. All right, whatever. And like I said, all the Pokemon that I'm gonna um I have my team will probably be used through cheat codes. However, one of them actually will well two of them, Murkrow and one um a one future one that I am planning on getting. You can actually get without cheats, but you know, yeah, you you actually can find Murkrow. Uh, you can find it wild. Uh, and I will show you. Uh, you can you can find it wild. Okay. What? Huh? Uh, wait. Yeah, you know you can find a yeah you can find a wild in, in Kanto, isn't it? I don't know. I searched it up and you can barely you, you can find a route seventeen or whatever. I think I think it's actually in Kanto. So yeah, I think you can find it, but you can't. We can only find it in Kanto. So I was wrong when I said you can find it later on in the game. Quite later on in the game, because you can actually go to Kanto in this game, but. Not for a while. Anyways, I'm gonna beat this Pidgey because I'm like a level higher than them. And almost got to level four. Whatever. Um, yeah. Oh no, you what my defense fell? Oh, seriously, give it up. Ah, uh, yes, killed him. Okay, sweet. Yeah, level four. Awesome. And almost level level five. Okay, cool. And I'm about to go fight a budge bug uh yeah. <laughs> I almost said we're gonna fight a budge catcher. Uh a bug catcher. I'm I'm gonna fight a bug catcher right here. And Peck is super effective on bug catchers, as you all know. So boom, level five and caterpie. And Peck, and Adios, and level 6! Wow. Okay, Bear is getting up there very fast. Um, alright, we'll get him up to one more level, and then, yeah. Um, also, I do have, oh yeah, right, um, yeah, this is the mistake that I made in part 1, I think. Um, yeah, if you come here without talking to your mom at once, you, you know, name your rival and stuff, um, like, if you don't talk, Ah, oh, man, I'm an idiot, if you don't talk to your mom, uh, once you leave after naming your rival, then once you get to this point, she will call you, and yeah. So it's probably better to actually go to your mom, uh, before you leave for your adventure. I don't know, I made, I made a big mistake. But anyways, it, it doesn't matter, she, she, you're gonna be talking to her either way. And she's gonna ask about money and stuff, say no, okay? She's gonna, she's gonna buy you stuff. My friend Ben thinks that it's so awesome that she buys you stuff. Um, for your, you know, she, she buys your stuff, but, like, seriously, like, you want the money for yourself. If you win money and you just give it to your mom, it's stupid. Like, one time she bought me a Moonstone, or I forget that was me or my friend, but she bought one of us a Moonstone, which is okay, but, seriously, like, just, like, crap, like, potions and stuff. I'm gonna actually kill this guy, because it's actually level, level 4, which will give me quite a bit of experience, but, seriously, like, just say no, okay? Don't, at, don't save money, okay? It's, it's a waste. Uh, anyways, yeah, this is the Dark Cave. We can't go anywhere, because we need Flash. Uh, let me see if I can actually get through this. No, I can't because yeah. All right. Oh crap! It's, oh look, it's a Geo dude. Okay, adios. I'm not, I ain't catching one because all my Pokemon will be caused with cheat codes. Plus, I can't even get a Golem because I can't trade on a ROM. But anyways, here's an antidote, or what I used to call an antidote. But seriously, that's what it looks like—an antidote. But anyways, uh, this is a Pokeball, I believe. All right. All right, cool. And there's a Bug Catcher here. It has four Pokemon. So I'm gonna just murder him. Level seven. Uh, I'm gonna switch to Greedo because I don't want my starter to be the equal level with my other Pokemon. So yeah. Level nine. Weedle. Eh, eh. Um. Tackle. Tackle. Oh, I'm poisoned. No. Um. All right. He was defeated. Oh uh, yeah, I'm poisoned, which means I could get screwed right now. Oh crap. Okay. Yeah. Wait. What level am I? What level Chikorita? Level nine. Uh. Okay. I'll put you. I guess. Uh, yeah, I'll get you to level 10, because I think you, I think Shikori, yeah, Shikori does learn Poison Powder, I think, at level 10. Level 10 or 11, I forget. Uh, anyways. Hey, here we are in Violet City! Now, this place looks a lot better in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, but I'm not complaining, because I like these games better than Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Anyways, let's heal up. Oh, wait, no, 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 Alright, good. Goodbye. Alright, now, before I end up the video, I'm going to point something out to, to all of you, uh, people out there. Now, here's the gym. Now, you can actually challenge the gym before, you, like, before you do it. Like, you can just, once you make it to Violet, Violet City, you can just go and battle the gym. Actually, in Heart Gold and Silver, you can't do that, because in Heart Gold and Silver, you have to do something before. And, 
I actually like doing this before um, I actually battle the gym. And if, this is the, the Sprout Tower, and crap, I should have turned off, I should have went off offline on Skype, but I didn't. Anyways, um, yeah, this is the Sprout Tower, experience of the way of Pokemon. Um, and there's a bunch of trainers in here, like a bunch of sages, and pretty much all they have is freaking Bell Sprouts. So, um, we're actually going to go in here and battle those guys later on, um, in the next part, actually. So yeah, that's all I have for now, guys. Thanks for watching. In the next part, like I said, like a second ago, I'm going to take on the Sprout Tower. And then the part after that, I'm going to take on the first gym. So thanks, guys, for watching. Um, I appreciate it. Um, stay tuned for more videos. God bless you all. Please write, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Adios.